Okay, guys, so this is a quick video about the final exam for English for study skills. Okay, so our final exam is one question. Okay, so not too difficult. Final exam is one question. The question comes in two parts. First of all, number one, we have done this before. Summarize the news article. You have done this before. So summarize the news article. And the second part is give me your opinion. Okay, so what do you think? Okay, what do you think about the news article? So I will just write that again in a different way. What is your opinion? Okay, what is your opinion? So to summarize part one, to summarize, if you remember, First of all, you would say, summarize the title, okay? Or you include the title. That's where a key piece of information is. The second part of your summary is the first few lines of the first paragraph. There's where the key information is, okay? And then the third part is the first part of the second paragraph. So this is where our key information will be. The title, the first few lines of the first paragraph, and the second part would be in the first part of the second paragraph. Okay, so this is to summarize. So let's summarize in briefly. Um, organizers say that uh, the Tokyo Olympics will still happen. Okay, so go ahead, go ahead, equals... Um, they will take place, yes, take place. Or you could also, like I said, happen. So you could say something like that. So don't just copy the title, change the wording a little bit, okay? Now, for the first paragraph, will they or won't they? Uh, reading this here, uh, there has been much speculation. So they have been talking a lot about whether it would happen or not. So you could say, people have been talking a lot about whether the Tokyo Olympics will happen. The president said it is their task to organize the Olympics, not to cancel them. So you could say something like that. Uh, he added that it would be a safe event. Okay, so he talks about a safe event, the keywords, um, and about the virus. People, there are concerns about passing on the virus. Okay, so part two, the games are due to open on the 23rd of July. Um, it is a logistical nightmare for authorities, so it's very difficult for authorities uh, to secure the safety of 11,000 athletes. So you then could say, to summarize, um, the games uh, are very difficult to organize to keep people safe from the virus. Um, and you, they could say that the government is really f obsessed. So the government is, the J Japanese government is really focused on hosting the Olympics and making them safe and not making it so that people would be at risk. So you could summarize something like that, okay? And then number two, part two, what do you think? You would normally start this, I think. If you remember we talked about this I think this is interesting because at the moment the virus is still spreading yeah so maybe you would talk about that or you could say I think this is good because it will make people feel more confident or I think this is good because um, if people cancel exams and uh, Olympic Games and they cancel so many different things then life feels like it is not normal. Something like that. I don't know. It's up to you what you think. Okay? So, 
for the final exam it will not be this article okay it will not be this article but it will be something very similar and I will just write summarize the news article and what do you think okay so the final exam for English for study skills will be exactly like this but a different news article okay so I have gone very very quickly because I want to make a really short video so that you can look and see at what you need to do okay I will send the exam this evening Possibly six, seven o'clock. I'm not sure, but I will send it this evening. And for the English for Airlines students, I will also send the other exam for English for Korea, but I will send you a little bit of study before that. Okay? So good luck, guys. It is not difficult. Please just focus. Part one, part two, part three, and then I think. Okay? Good luck. Thank you, guys. See you soon.